had some questions this week from the viewers wanting to know what the kids pack and take to Disney World. Here is their Disney World backpack. And then here are some of the stuff that they bring all the time because you never know when they may need it. Ears. Hunter is a regular for wearing Mickey Mouse ears. She loves wearing her little uh, zebra print ones. These are the glow ears, which are a little bit more expensive, but they're really fun for as often as we're at Disney World and in the evening, we can use the glow ears for like Fantasmic or if there's anything going on at Magic Kingdom, uh, Wishes Fireworks, they work for that as well. As you know, Disney has all these fun nighttime things that you can buy that are super expensive. I bought this at Hobby Lobby on sale 50% off and it was like $4.99 and it's got 50 8 inch glow sticks that you can do, necklaces, bracelets, bunny ears, flowers, you name it. So a bunch of stuff. So I just carry this and the kids in the evening, if you know they're at the parks when it's at nighttime, instead of buying something we just pull these out and the kids play with those. So a great way to kind of save some money. Super inexpensive souvenirs, those pressed pennies. The kids love it. So we pack quarters and pennies, and there is their penny holder. So we always have that, so as soon as they press the penny, they can put it right in here to keep it. Autograph books. <laughs> the autograph books, we have a cruise one and a Disney World one, and I think the characters have yeah, see here I go, put my to it. Two Donald Duck, I lost the other one. Two Donald Duck signatures, there you go. Donald Duck, Donald Duck. They have almost two of every character in here. But it's nice to have, have them with you just in case. And then of course you wanna have a pen. The Disney cast member will have a pen if you need it, but always bring the Sharpies just because it's easier and then you don't have to borrow anything, you're ready to go. And then Kelly is a big book person. So we have Kim's book, which is really fun. And then Tracy's Adventure Guide, um, which is really fun for the kids. It's almost homeschool stuff. And then the new Disney in Details. And of course we have Steve's book as well, The Hidden Mickey Guide. But Kelly loves the book, so we pack his book so he has them when he wants them. Cell phone, this is my cell phone, but Hunter has a cell phone that's really not a phone, it's more of an iPad. And then Kelly has his iPad. Bring those because you can play heads up in line, um, they can do ingress, all kinds of activities. So always have a cell phone or a smartphone just so they have something that they can do while you're waiting in line. That is, in a nutshell, our backpack of stuff for the kids. Um, now one thing that's not in here that we actually left at in Orlando, um, so we're going to pick that up next time we're in Orlando, is Hunter's Sorcerers of the Magic Kingdom. She actually has a book, a three ring binder, with all her Sorcerers of the Magic Kingdom cards inside. So that's one more thing that we're going to add to the backpack, but that is our Disney World backpack.